PIPI stands for Home Instruction for Parents for Preschool Youngsters. We have highly trained home instructors teaching our parents how to get their three, four, and five-year-old children academically ready for school. Joining me today to talk about this incredible HIPPIE program is Manager Gabby Hernandez, Assistant Superintendent for Families and Community Engagement, Jorge Arendondo, and HIPPIE Home Instructor, Faye Lowe. Gabby, you've been with FACE for many years. Can you tell us a little bit about the HIPPIE program? Sure. The HIPPIE program is an international program that started with the National Council of Jewish Women at the University of uh, Hebrew University of, of Jerusalem about 46 years ago. It was brought into United States in 1984 and came to Houston ISD 10 years after that. The HIPPIE program uh, contains two main um, potential uh, additions in their program. First is the curriculum, and second is the role play. The curriculum is a 30-week length uh, program. You know, the curriculum, you visit the parents into the house for 30 times, and they, again, they get to spend like probably 60 minutes teaching the parent is that role play. The role play method is very unique in HIPPIE program because we teach the parents how to utilize those tools to prepare their babies for school. So also, uh, the HIPPIE program um, hires parents from the community to become home instructors. So the parents earn that confidence, they really uh, get empowered to teach the, the babies in the house. We targeted parents from three, four, and five-year-olds, and we uh, help them to get ready for school. Great. So Jorge, can you tell us what are the long-term academic benefits of this kind of program? Mm -hmm. Well, in family and community engagement, uh, one of our flagship programs, like you mentioned, our HIPPIE program, is meant to intervene and uh, prevent parents uh, from uh, making sure that they have success in school. So we want to build the capacity of our parents as partners, we want to make sure that we empower them to be the first teachers at home. And so we do this through this program. Uh, we will be serving over 750 families this year, wow. and we're looking forward to uh, going out to the homes and making sure that these parents uh, participate and also learn on how best they can uh, ensure that their child is not only going to be successful at the elementary level, but really beyond that. Uh, moving forward. So Faye, you actually go into the homes where the parents are. Can you tell us a little bit about what that looks like and what the parents' reactions are to the lessons and the materials? Usually what happens is I take the curriculum out which are, explains what we're going to be doing, which is like a five domain. We're going to teach them about the math, the language, the English, the motor skills, and the lit literacy. And normally when I tell them that, they are usually kind of like shocked until I actually bring the material in. And we sit down and I tell them we're going to do role playing with the parent and the child. And we're going to take turns uh, going over the lesson. And usually once I explain it to them and we start doing it, the excitement on their face is like, wow. Uh, so many things that they don't know that I'm showing them how to do and how to teach their child. They get excited. They be looking forward to the next week and then the 30 weeks on because of the benefit that they receive are uh, from being in the program. And the, with the children, what also the, what we bring to the home books and the parents can actually read to the children and tell them about what they're reading and how to work the lessons and they, they're excited. And how often do you go in, in? I go once a week and I normally spend from 45, they say to 60 minutes to go over the lesson. And we suggest that each day they work on one domain a day. Uh, for five days. And the following week, I go back with the second lesson, and then with the first lesson, I go over it to see how they worked on it. And if they did, I take a page from it. I don't tell them what page, we build up a, a scrapbook for the child. So we have a graduation ceremony, and we give them the book, certificate for being a part of the program and working with the kid. Wonderful. And about how many kids do you have per caseload, like on your caseload? 16. We have 16 families. Okay and we set up a schedule, and we try to set up a schedule that's uh, workable for the parent as well. Mm -hmm. And normally, if there is something that comes up, they can't come or uh, attend the day that we set, we reschedule. So we want it to be as convenient for the family so they can stay in the as program possible. as possible. Mm -hmm. So everything works, works out. Mm -hmm. So Gabby, with having a caseload like that, where she has to touch those families weekly, what kind of support does HISD offer to our instructors? To the home instructors. Well, first of all, this is a parent-to-parent -parent program. Mm 
So we uh, identify parents within the communities for they to become HISD hourly employees. So what we do for them is like we pay for benefits, we also pay for mileage, and uh, they are hourly employees. They got 30 hours, $10 mm -hmm. per hour. As a matter of fact, today we are hiring. We still have uh, opening positions. And we also have a MediCorps program. The AmeriCorps program give uh, some of my home instructors and a scholarship so we can prepare them and encourage them to go back to school. Wow. So our parents really take advantage of this. Being a home instructor, they, they can earn this educational award and they can continue their education. Most of our home instructor, for most of those uh, elements working in HIPI, this is the first job. So really they have the opportunity to get professional development through HISD, through our department, and also uh, they start looking for more avenues to support their own family, like, like, I, like I say, going back to college and give back to their community, because that is in their heart. They love to serve. They really love to go into the houses and, de and see those beautiful smiles from the babies that I learned something. So the home instructors are already empowered with the training that we provide in a weekly basis we really support our team. I think that um, also on Thursdays, the, the role play that they get to do with each other has also been very uh, important for us to support our home instructors. We want to make sure that we deliver a quality program to the families, and it is not the first time that they go out to the homes that they actually are, are talking about the curriculum. They actually practice the curriculum with each other, and we've also had computer training this summer that we've added to the our trainings for our home instructors to so make sure that they uh, continue to update their skills and uh, and be able to contribute uh, as well. And we this year we added our cultural proficiency training uh, that was able to. We know Houston has many diverse uh, backgrounds, people from different backgrounds. It's important that we understand to meet our parents where they are and be able to be understanding. So if we have a parent who somehow wanted to get involved with Hippie and had a preschool child, how would they go about doing that? Oh, absolutely. We are enrolling families right now. They just need to contact the office, which mm -hmm. is appearing on the screen right now, and also going to uh, our website. It's also on the screen. And uh, give us a call, and we enroll their child. Uh, also, they need to, it's free. They need to know that this program is free to the parents. We provide them with the curriculum, the storybooks, and some supplies that they're going to be utilizing throughout the program, and also other benefits. Uh, the Family and Community Engagement Department, they provide with books at the end of the, uh, the course, so we can uh, start the library book in the school. So they take many, benef many, uh, many benefits for being a, a hippie child, you know, hippie parent. Wonderful. Probably, well, certainly it's Probably like uh, something else that I want to make sure that families know out there, uh, trustee, is that this program is free. We go out to the homes, and maybe parents think they're doing a good job right now, but they can do that much better job if they ensure that we enroll in this, if they enroll in this program, because we have evidence to show that when these kids start kindergarten, first and second grade, they're outperforming our other HISD peers. And so mm -hmm. when you start to see that the, the kids are reading more, they're doing better in math and social studies. That's what parents want for their child. So we know that they're doing some good things, but if they give us this opportunity, they're going to do that much better when they start school. Absolutely. Well, certainly, I want to thank you for um, coming to do this and sharing that valuable bit of information. Um, we do know that the earlier we get our kids involved in literacy, the better off they are. So it's mm -hmm. a worthwhile effort and a wonderful program. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you for having me.